Hello YouTube, it's DTA Show, Resident 2 Let's Play, part 49, the last part, we got to the dark room and killed some zombies and Adam wasted two shots of liquor. Piss off. <laughs> In this part we're going to head You ran away, alright. <laughs> I'm sticking to that. <laughs> it right. ran away from me. Okay, 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 it ran away from you, we, we believe you. That's all you should. <laughs> anyway, let's get to the um, police's office and talk to Leon. Because that's where the plot is. I don't think he's in the, the office. Do you want to pause it while I start this puzzle again? Yeah, go on. Because this puzzle's pretty easy and we've already shown you how to do it already in a previous video. We've talked about it twice so far. I mm. honestly don't think he was a paedophile. Right, we're back. Now to solve this puzzle. D to solve this puzzle is pretty simple. Just push the statues, both the statues to their face and the other statue at the opposite side of the room. Yes, what he said. <laughs> it's a very simple puzzle and it's very easy. But when you describe it, it seems... More maddening. complicated. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, time to shoot some policemen. Thank goodness not Robocop. Grand Theft Auto. Well, there's no one here. Oh, uh, this is a completely policeman-free zone. When did you see policemen over here? Oh, well, go, go in the office and... Pick up your grenade launcher. Is it a grenade launcher? Grenade? Oh. Well, who said it was in there? I think it might be. I forget. I have no idea. I couldn't care less. No, we're not getting the film this time, I believe you. <laughs> nope. I'm not going after the film. Should be some uh, ammo down here somewhere. Try the, um. Ah, ah gotcha. Got it. Moving on. You found Wesker's mouldy old cheeseburger. Yeah. Yay. <laughs> what use does this have in the game? You can use it to kill one zombie. It shoves it in its mouth. All commit suicide. <laughs> and Chris's diary and the unicorn medal thing. Why couldn't it be a real unicorn? That'd have been cool. A real unicorn here is an evil game. Talk to the, um, Packy, uh... Oh. Okay, try talking to the desk. No, no, you can't. Yep. Oh, try the cupboard then. Ah, oh, fuck you. Uh, That's for the little three bit to talk to that. Switchboard. Grenade launcher. You can take the G launcher. You got six grenade rounds. Oh. It's printing something. Fax machine going off. <laughs> What's the point? This entire town has been completely screwed over by zombies. Who the hell's sending me faxes? <laughs> Maybe it's someone, someone out of town. Do all these people know that Raccoon City is sort of... Maybe the fax was sent before they found out? Maybe. Because, you know, fax machines do take about a while to transmit data, I think. Not that long. Right, where do we go next? Uh, go back to uh... the the main entrance and put the unicorn going in. That's it. Yep, I'm gonna pause it. Mm, now nah, we'll watch you walk back. <laughs> Fair enough. I can't bother pressing the pause button at the moment. That's just lazy. <laughs> Backtracking is boring. At least I killed everything, so there's one less to worry about. Mm, you won't have to deal with Mr. X on this playthrough, will you? You've got, um... No, I won't! You mean I can walk around safely? Yeah, you can. Well, having said that... <laughs> got arms coming through the windows. Yeah. I want you, Claire! I want you! <laughs> give us a kiss, love. <laughs> okay, I'll give you a kiss. Kiss my foot! <laughs> <laughs> Jump into the kit's the head off. Moving on. But only the karate kid can do that. Yeah, well, I'm the next karate kid. <laughs> Isn't that a woman? Yeah. A girl. It's not a very good film either. It's probably the worst one out of the three out of the four. 
Yeah. Did you know Mr. Miyagi was based on a real person? Yeah. Yeah, did you? Mm -hmm. I would like to propose a toast to the real Mr. Miyagi. Yay! Thank you. <laughs> Acknowledgement, please. Hey, you put the coin in this uh, statue, and the statue is the most epic cutscene ever. Traps your fingers and throws the key at you. <laughs> fantastic. Wasn't that fantastic? Wasn't that riveting? Wasn't that just... Oh, it was crap, wasn't it? Yes. <laughs> right, you take this key, you can go get the um, lighter now, but your infantry is getting full, Adam. It'll have to do. Put the um, gem away. I'll throw this gem in here. Um, uh, I'll leave that for the time being as well. I'm going for the. Um, I'm going to put the bow away and use the grenade launcher. True, but I'm, even though the uh, second scenario is quite generous with uh, grenade rounds, I'm not sure how generous this one's going to be. Well, he can't. He kill Mr. X and get six and get six and get six and kill him for four and get two free. I remember that. I sh I shot him with like four grenade rounds and he gave me like six back. Yeah. So yeah, it was on. It's, it was almost getting punched in the face. Almost worth getting punched in the face. Sorry. All right, move the step ladder, whatever it is. You can probably reach the thing. You just move your arm upwards. Well, you can probably <laughs> jump up there and get it, you? Crank. Will you take the crank? I will take the crank. I now have the crank. Right. I am not feeling epic. You might as well drop the crank off because you won't need it for a while. Uh, I shouldn't think so. Well, put the crank back. Wherever it's supposed to go. I know, you meant to go t towards the um, star's office. You went the wrong way. I'm putting my crank back. But there's a dark room in between there and there. You've always got to complicate things with <laughs> common sense, haven't you? <laughs> well, yeah. Well, this one's closer, shut up. The game gives you a map. So you can plan your route. I'm a man! I don't use maps! <laughs> No wonder we didn't get no wonder we had problems getting off to towers a few years ago. That's cause that nutter nearly ran us off the road. <laughs> what the hell was he on? True. Yeah, we're in bloody hell! I don't usually get road rage, but that guy scared the shit out of me. <laughs> we had Who are you, what are your friend's name? Philip. Philip was trying to navigate and you were trying to drive. And I said, Will you just show up, Adam, it's that way? Yes. And I got us there. Yes, you did. Yeah. <laughs> Smart ass. Me and me and Phil arguing which way we're supposed to go. No, no, you just go. Turn just out. go that way. It's over there, and <laughs> it's over there. Now you now you know why I don't drive him anywhere anymore. <laughs> That's why it's been two years since we last went to Alton Towers. Two years. Oh, pretty much. I forget. I like to go to Fort Park in London. I'm not driving you to London. <laughs> <laughs> I've never been to you Fort... drive yourself to London. <laughs> <laughs> I've never been to Fort Park, but I think it's a good theme park. I've never, I've never had, um, you know, a scaffolding bar to the back of the head, but I'm not, I'm, I'm, I've been told it hurts. <laughs> I don't really need to uh, experience, experience it. it. All right. Oh. Anyway, the oh. black bars have appeared, meaning we have a rather. Crap cutscene with a <laughs> rather <laughs> half-assed voice actor. Anyway, you two run out of time. See you next part.